Hey guys, this is your friend Mainak from Civil Center and I welcome all of you back to our channel and another video on Revit Structures. So friends, in today's video, we'll show you how to generate the drawing of a particular section in Revit Structures and how to, you know, start with the arrangement of the final structural drawing sheet. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So let's say we want the drawing of this particular section. So we can go to the particular view of it. Let's say we'll go to level 2, which is the particular view uh, which in which this drawing has been made so we have a section before you can uh, also create a new section or else you can select this section and you can go to modify and after that you can rotate this so uh, let's say we define a particular uh, you know axis for the rotation and then we can rotate this uh, like this and also you can move this particular if you select want to move this you can select this and you can move it a bit downwards so that this column because we want this particular view containing our columns so we'll go in this view right click on it and we can go to view and after that we'll zoom in we don't want the entire view we can uh, if you don't want the entire view we can also reduce it also by clicking on this we want to do this part okay so now we want to annotate uh, the dimensions and also the reinforcement which has been given here uh, first of all let's you know change this uh, scale to 1 is to uh, let's say 25 so we have you know the dimensions visible and we'll change this graphics to let's say fine and now we will annotate some things so we'll go to annotate and we'll select the align dimensions this one and this one and we'll draw the dimension of the footing and if you want you can also uh, you know generate the dimension of this particular thing so we have the dimension of the footing and if you want you can also change the text style and all you have all the options in uh, the particular uh, option of your annotate so if you see you can also change the text style style as well so uh, now the next thing which we want to do is we have like uh, an option of multi rebar so using that we can just display this so we will click up to here and we'll show this 8 mm stirrups and we can just place it here so there are three clicks in total like this we can also denote this this part this part let's denote this side single click here and for this for placing that single click again here and the last single click for this so like this will denote the you know the particular ties at the end like this and again so like this we can denote uh, the particular uh, ties now for this this bars we can also denote them by using this we'll place it this side uh, so like this you can denote uh, the particular you know uh, bars so this is how you define a particular section in uh, Revit structures so after you have uh, you know done that you can you know arrange this into a final structural drawing sheet we had made an earlier video on how to uh, you know uh, how to get the rebar schedule as well so we'll uh, incorporate all the three things like the plan uh, the, the footing schedule and this uh, particular section uh, into the drawing and before that we'll just show you another small thing which uh, you know we can do it so you can go to view and we have an option of call out here and this is basically a section of a section if you want like a section of a particular zone here let's say we'll cut a section from here to here so uh, you can uh, click on it and uh, you know go to view so this is the section of a section you can just create uh, this using a call out command so if you want to delete uh, this call out you have to select this and you can go to modify and after that you have this option of deleting and just simply delete this so now we'll go uh, to our option of your view and we have you know option of a sheet here a1 metric you can you know load uh, div different title blocks also for you know different sheets so let's just go with the default one a1 uh, metric sheet 
so now we'll import our level 2 or the foundation level plan so the, uh, whatever the foundation level plan is named in your sheet you can import this we have imported this and uh, we can next you know import our sections section 1 let's place it here and we have the section here as you can see the section and we have you know this uh, footing here and let's also you know uh, take the rebar schedule and place it here so if you observe we have the rebar schedule we have the rebar schedule which we had made if you want to see how to make that you can watch our video which has been given right over here and this is the section and this is the this is the particular foundation plan in which in this way you can prepare a sheet so we'll try to make more videos on this sheet preparation and if you like this video you can share with your friends and if you want to get trained from us professionally in tecla structural designer tecla structures leverage structures or statro or any other software related to civil engineering you can contact us bye bye